Ofsted have described the Colleton Grammar School as outstanding in the last three inspections. Set in very attractive grounds, we've got excellent facilities and over the last 20 years we've worked continuously to improve the facilities for the students at this school. My name is Paul Evans, I'm head teacher at Colleton Grammar School. I've been teaching here since 1997 and I've been head teacher since 2008. Over the last decade we've made significant improvements to the facilities at the school. New study centres for the sixth form, new art, music and drama facilities, science labs, technology, maths, lots of areas where we have invested so that children have the best facilities. I'm very proud to lead a school that's been educating children in East Devon since 1546 when some local merchants, the Fearfees, founded a school here for the children of Colleton. But we now serve children from East Devon, South Somerset and West Dorset. Our Colleton Grammar School offers a selective school education. We're the only school in a 50 mile radius and we've been on this site since 1927 and we serve children approximately the top 20% of the ability range. The school has high expectations of all of its pupils and we try to nurture their academic and their social development and value everything that they do. The school regularly finds itself in the top 10 results nationally for GCSE and top 5 for A level. At GCSE our value added is second highest of the top 200 schools in the country. The curriculum at Collison is unique. All of our students complete Key Stage 3 in just two years. They then go on to do GCSE, which they complete by the end of year 10, and then move into a three-year sixth form programme. Here they do four academic A-levels, general studies, critical thinking, and extended project qualification. But importantly, they also have time for other things and for extension activities, enrichment, and developing as independent learners. Although we're very keen to maintain very high academic standards in the sixth form, the three-year sixth form also gives time for sport, drama, music, and other activities that develop young people as individuals. There's also time for work experience and community work, which is important in developing life skills for life at university and beyond. So I'm a member of um, sports teams, netball, hockey. In the summer, there's different ones as well, tennis, badminton. And I think there's a great opportunity for you to join anything you really want, really, yeah. isn't it? And if there's not something you want, then you can start it up. Can't yeah, you? like you started, or well, you've been involved with CU. Yeah, I've been involved with CU. Yeah. And there's choir, there's music clubs, there's science club, science clubs. ten tours, DOV. I did ten tours at the weekend. Yeah. <laughs> this is a bit of everything, really. Isn't yeah, it? something for everyone. As a 21st century school, we're keen to use new technologies to enhance teaching and learning. We're well equipped with ICT facilities, interactive whiteboards, virtual learning environments, and we're always looking for new ways to use technology to enhance teaching. We're a small school with a dedicated staff who are keen to support and stretch and challenge our young people. Ofsted commented on the remarkable degree of high quality teaching in this school. They also commented on the trust there is between students and learners. Uh, I'd say the main thing is just respect for the staff really um, and also just get on with them really well. It's not sort of like a fear factor, it's not like an authoritarian relationship, you know, you can, you can have a joke around with them as well and it's just really good fun and they all love their subjects and that kind of makes you respect them really. It's not uncommon for teachers to do extra lunchtime clubs if you're struggling or just clubs for fun to come and experiment more. They really do like push extra for their subject, they really do care. Most of our students go on to university and it's very important that we give them the skills to be independent learners and cope in that academic environment. We've got a good track record of securing students places in challenging courses like medicine and dentistry and at Oxford and Cambridge. I think we've been prepared really well for university. We've had personal interviews with connections tutors, um, tutorials on how to write applications and um, personal statements. We've been to UCAS conferences, um, Oxbridge conferences and the teachers, yeah, they're really supportive. Offset talk about Colton having a very positive ethos. If you come and visit us, you'll see a caring, sharing community where staff support students to become highly motivated learners by teaching them the skills they need in every subject. You can explore yourself more in secondary school, um, especially here. There's loads of opportunities to take um, and already it's, we're halfway through the year and I feel as welcome as I'll ever be. And I came to the school um, on my own, nobody else from my primary school, but within a few days, weeks, I've made loads of new friends virtually everybody in the tutor group. Ofsted says we educate some impressively confident and assured young people. We think this is a friendly and supportive school. 
and we'd like to invite you to one of our open days to come and see it for yourself.